How is it to go one night out there, everybody? This is Jordan Jones on my playthrough of Super Mario Maker 2 for the Nintendo Switch. If you guys give me a favor and drop a like on the video, I'd really appreciate that. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click on that subscribe button. And click on the bell right beside it to be notified every time my new videos come out. And let me know down in the comments below for questions of the video, what gameplay style from Mario platforming do you prefer, 2D or 3D, and why? Like I've said several times, I like the 3D Mario games more than 2D. Okay, so I'm not doing it real great on this mission. I like the 3D Mario games more than 2D because... Like I said, I like the 3D Mario games more than 2D. Um, Cause like I said, for the three for the two D Mario classic games, I can never get the feel for them because the controls just felt kind of slippery, and I've always hated games that felt really really slippery. That's probably why I didn't really like the two D Mario games that like the classic two D Mario games that much. That's why I didn't really like them that much. How do I do this safely? I don't even know how to do it safely. Um, it's only a two-star difficulty. This is actually harder than it looks. This is harder than I thought it would be. Okay, how do I do this? Oh, you use the donut blocks. I see it now. I get it now. Okay. I don't want time to run out. So I have to wait until the proper amount gets over here of these. So I have to ride this down now. There we go. Perfect. What too hard? Uh, it was it was just complicated. It wasn't too hard or anything. Like I said, I I played the 3D games more than I have the original 2D classic Mario games. The reason why I never really liked the original classic Mario games that much is because, especially since I played, I grew up with the new Super Mario Bros. games and the 3D Mario games, and they improved when it came to the control with Mario. And that whenever I played the classic 2D Mario games, they were just really, really slippery to me. And I've always hated games that felt really, really slippery. So that's probably why also that I didn't really like, um... And that's probably why I didn't really like the classic 2D Mario games that much, just because I felt like they were slippery. And that's also why I didn't really like, um... That's also why I didn't really like Super Mario 64 that much either, just because I felt like it was slippery. Come on. We need more coins. Target a single pom-pom. 
by Mr. Eraser. Are you serious? Is that easy? Is that easy? Are you serious? Is it that easy? I guess this will give us 240 coins. Since it'll be 200 plus the 40 that we have. Oh, it's just 40 that we got. Let's go in the pot. We need to get enough coins. Let's go ahead and do this. Hopefully we'll get enough coins. I'm really glad I'm getting to continue my Breath of the Wild playthrough. Cause I know I quit for cause I know back in March I quit for a while. Back in um back in April of this year. I, I did a playthrough of Donkey Kong Country Returns. That playthrough was so much fun. You should definitely go back and watch that. We had a fun time doing that. Donkey Kong Country Returns was just a really, really good game. Also, in, um... Also, in after I did my Donkey Kong Country Returns playthrough, I did a playthrough of Super Mario World for the Super Nintendo, but I never finished that one, and I'm never gonna finish that one because I decided I didn't like Super Mario World that much, mainly because it was slippery, and it, and I've always hated games that felt really, really slippery. Um, that's probably why I didn't really like Super Mario World that much for the Super Nintendo. And that's why I didn't really like the classic 2D Mario games that much, just because I felt like they were slippery. Ooh, excuse me. Um, so... Excuse me. This one should be easy. I know a lot of people like Super Mario World and whatnot, but Super Mario World was always really, really slippery to me. I just couldn't get used to it as much as I could like the new Super Mario Bros. games or the 3D Mario games, because they improved when it came to the control with Mario, and those were so fluid. Yes! 
This was an easy one. We did it pretty easily. Wow. Alright, so I think we're gonna have over 1200. 1208. Maybe all he has is one more. High atop Thwomp Tower. Three star difficulty. <sighs> Alright, so here we go. I'd like to do another single segment speedrun of Mike Tyson's Punch Out and try to get sub 20. Okay, that's my next goal in Mike Tyson's Punch Out. Just like my next goal in um, Super Punch Out is to try to get sub 250. Maybe that'll be someday. Maybe not anytime soon, but someday. I'm already in the sub 3 club for speedrunning Super Punch Out. Whoa, I did not anticipate that to want. So, I'm just telling you what my plans are maybe sometime in the future for me speedrunning those games like MTPO and SPO because I love speedrunning those games. Maybe I'll try to go for a sub-20 in MTPO and, and sub-250 in SPO. I already got a sub-3 in SPO and I'll leave a link of that in the description of my sub-30 speedrun of if you want to check out my sub-30 single segment speedrun I did for my for Super Punch-Out, don't forget to click on the link in the description below. If you want to check out my sub-30 for Super Punch-Out, just click on the link in below and you can check it out. Okay, so we got to be fast, we got to be fast, we got to be fast. Alright. That was easy. This level went too hard. Wow! That wasn't too hard. That wasn't too hard, but... But we did it. It wasn't too hard, but we did it. I got squished! Give me a power up to work with, or do I have to do it this way? Seems like they're not gonna be nice to me. And give me a power up. Okay, that's probably the best way to do that right there, is just to use that strategy. And I almost got squished again. There we go! We're done! I don't care if we get the top of the flagpole or not. <sighs> Most important thing to me is that we're done. done alright guys that was it thank you very much for watching guys if you did enjoy don't forget to drop a like on the video and if you're new to my channel don't forget to click on that subscribe button 
and click on the bell right beside me. No bite every time my new videos come out. If you want to check out my um, sub three single segment speed run I did for Super Punch Out um, a couple months ago, actually several months ago, don't forget to click on that link in the description below and have a great day, guys. Peace.